Hello everybody and welcome back to the episode of the new so far. We are jumping in again and we are on a three streak. Um, who are we gonna go as? Who are we gonna go as? Maybe I should just do random, but I don't know. There's certain characters like these two that I don't particularly want to play much. Um, Icarus is just still in a really... Honestly, these two characters are in a really weird spot and could do with some, some reworks and tweaks to make them a bit more approachable, I think. Um... Who should we go as? Maybe the Keeper. Let's do a Keeper run. Um, try and do Beast, I guess, we've got to go for. I mean, is it Beast? Wait. Okay. I was like, how have we unlocked Tainted Keeper but not done Beast? But technically, it's because we've... Um, it's because we've gone to the Beast. We've never beaten the Beast. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Hold up. I remember that's a thing now. Uh, what the hell's this? Um, Sculpted Pepper. On you spawns a uh, stone block, uh, attacking the block chisels it. Fully chisels the block, which is an aura that gives a stat. Hmm. Kind of interesting. Unfortunately, it's obviously not very good for us because we'd have to give up our active item. It's kind of an interesting idea, but yeah, unfortunately, we would have to give up our active item. And I cannot do that as this character, so that's a little bit out of the question uh, for us. Which is a shame on the first floor, especially being a quality 3 item as well. Uh, as the keeper, you don't want to be losing out on your first item room item, but it is what it is. Uh, treasure rooms will re be replaced with devil deals. Ooh. That could be intriguing. Now, I've got to basically get enough money to make that worthwhile before I um before I commit to it because we could lose a lot more item room items if if I uh, I don't get the items I need for that okay this is already sketchy okay that was actually <laughs> that looked really sketchy but ended up being really easy uh, unfortunately we're getting really unlucky with our uh, wooden nickel at the minute and not getting many procs of it which is a shame as for the question of the day today um hmm I've not got a good one in mind today blah, 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 blah. What's, what's a stopper in your life? What's something at the minute that's stopping you doing something you want to do? I feel like that's always an interesting one. Dude, we're getting really unlucky with our wooden nickel so far. I was thinking, oh, if we get a bunch of pennies here, we can easily make it work for the, um... For the... Trinket we just got. But, at the minute, so far, we've had, like, one pull of wooden nickel be successful. Maybe two out of all of these rooms. So, so far, not so good. I'm going to stick with the trinket for now, though. It's it's definitely risky, but I think it could work. I'm a little bit worried about this guy. Unfortunately, Golden Plum Flute is another active, so I can't take that. It would be nice to, but not really worth it for us right now. Uh, ooh, and we get a very good item out of this. Very nice. Okay, I'm going to stick with it. It's, this, is, this is very much a gamble and could put me in a, a spiral of, uh, of pain. Okay, there's a penny this time. Good, good. Just got to hope that my uh, my nickel pays out a little more often. And hope it pays out with some nickels and dimes. If it pays out some nickels and dimes. Sometimes I get really lucky. Um, also as well, someone calculated for me. There was another episode quite a while back where... Oh, that was very stupid. Uh, there was another episode quite a while back where I got three nickels in a row. And someone calculated the odds of that happening. And it was just astronomical how low the chances of that happening were. It was kind of crazy. Um... So we've already generated the item room at this point, so we're kind of stuck in it. I'm a little, I'm a little worried. <laughs> I think I might not end up getting an item here. And if it's a 30 cent item, we're completely out of luck. But, you never know. Oh dude, it's, it's just screwing me right now. That's a pretty good trinket. Although no, it replaces this trinket, it's the whole point of this run. Good. Oh god, these tails are uh, vivacious. No, 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 no. Please stay away. Okay, one of you's dead at least. Ah. No, you big bad bitch. God damn it. It's a waste of a penny. Dude, this wooden nickel, man. <laughs> Getting unlucky, I am. Getting unlucky. At least the keeper starts with 3 HP now. That's such a godsend. 
Like, remember when he didn't have 3 HP? God damn. Sad times. Yeah, it looks like our item room is going to be a big fat zero at the minute. I might bomb my donation machine to get enough money for it, depending on what it is. Cool. Yeah, I might bomb a donation machine, depending on what the item ends up being. Let's go and check that out first, shall we? That's, that's a good item as well there, damn. Right, what we got in here, first of all. Okay, we can actually afford it, surprisingly, uh, which is not something I was expecting, but I will take that. Uh, I, I might still bomb my donation machine, to be honest, though. It might still be worthwhile. Let's see what we got going on in here. Um, sometimes you can get a bit shafted by the donation machine and it give you basically nothing, but this time we did not. Lovely. Okay, that's, that's put me in a happy spot. I'm good with that. Um, and we'll keep this trinket rolling. I've been very mean to my donation machine as of late, but I think it's worth it. Uh, we could quickly check on secret room here, to be honest. Um, I think it can only be right here. Uh, let me... Actually, no, it's got two places it can be. Okay, it's got less places it can be now. A lot less places it can be now. Okay, now I'm confused. <laughs> now I'm thoroughly confused. Where the hell is it? It might be here? It might also be below here. Okay, no. So it's probably... It's probably here. There you go. Using a lot of bombs, but getting a lot of money is pretty worthwhile. Honestly, I'd like a key as well, so... I'd like to open one of these and get a key. Yeah, 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 baby. Okay. I'm feeling far more confident now. I'm probably going to go Angel Deal as well, considering me getting Devil Deals from other places. I don't know if this active item actually block. Uh, sorry, this trinket actually blocks you from getting natural Angel Deals. It might. I'm going to check, actually. What, what's, what's it called? It's called Dark Prince's Crown or something, isn't it? Devil's Crown. Right. Let me quickly go check on the Google. Um, Devil's Crown Isaac. Right, let's see. Um, okay. Items bought in the Devil Room will affect Angel Room chance like a normal Devil Deal would. Okay, so we, we, we are blocked out of Angel Deal by taking these, so we might as well just go to the Devil Deal here. And we got Dark Matter, that's pretty good. Dark Matter's decent. But yeah, so we are kind of locked into Devil Deal here, so this is not ideal. Um, simply because we could get kind of screwed over here by, um having too many devil deals, which is a problem you wouldn't normally think would be a problem for this guy, but hey-ho. If our uh, active could start producing the coinage that we need, that'd be lovely. Excuse me, buddy. Does fear really have to make you do that? Ooh, that. That's the sauce right there. That is the sauce right there. We like to see it. We like to see it. But yeah, we'll see how this end up, ends up going. Not getting treasure room items can be a detriment. But we don't have to trade HP. We instead trade health. I feel like it's far better. The fear is actually lovely right now. I think, for the most part, fear is a pretty good status effect. I think a lot of people don't like it, and, well, to be fair, I know a lot of people don't like it, because it can make things somewhat unpredictable. But overall, I think it's pretty good. Don't know where those blue flies came from. Don't think there's any way for us to get those without flight. That coin, why not? Good, good. Um, unfortunately, that's not very valuable for us. It is just flies. Okay, this guy, unfortunately, she's going to eat all these coins. Not like we have flight anyways, but... Hey, her pills I'm not interested in right now. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Beauty. What I'm looking for, baby. 
yeah, money is in a good spot right now. Back up to 25 cent again. And we get ourselves an air wars here. Nice. Uh, where's, where are we going to use this air wars? Does this count? I don't know if that counts. I'm going to find something that's more, less ambiguous. I think, I think mushroom is definitely less ambiguous. Yeah, there you go. We get ourselves whatever the hell this is. Can we get over this chest? No, we can't. Book of Shadows. Unfortunately, not gr not great for us, but it is a book towards bookworm, so not bad. Unfortunately, we're in the in the state of getting active items right now, which isn't ideal. But at least we got our health back after touching that um, that chest, so don't feel as bad there. Right, pop that down. Unfortunately, nothing. Okay, big boy. I know you're going to be an issue. Oh, fear makes you stop shooting your little ball. That's nice. Is there more than one of you? Good. Okay. Chest. Oh, ho, 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 ho. The coins. The coins are coming. And we get ourselves the Devil's Harvest, which I think is just a revive as... The Fiend, which is, I guess, better than not having a revive, but I know that this revive can be a bit glitchy and it, it takes full priority over any other revives, which is really annoying. Like, even if you have, like, nine lives, it'll take priority over it. Uh, what does this do again? Transfers bomb rocks and troll bombs into bomb pickups, downgrades explosive enemies into their regular versions. Okay, so basically we can defuse some, some, uh, tin, um, troll bombs if we come across them. Which is something, I guess. Check this out, I guess. Yeah. That was so goddamn worth it. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank god there was a lot of money in here, because I got hit so much then. Holy shit. <laughs> that was so funny. Oh my god. I mainly wanted to do this just because I get three uses on wooden nickel to get some more money. Turns out that chest was like the most valuable thing possible. Goddamn. Three nickels in one chest. Who'd have thunk? I don't think fear does anything to these guys. Nice. Don't know why I used it again there. That was a bad idea. Now I don't have a use for my boss fight. Should I go into my shop? I guess there is a few things in my shop that are pretty valuable. A um, few items that I would like to see. So maybe it is worthwhile. Let's go take a little, a little sneaky peeky, shall we? Um, toy drum's pretty good. Toy drum's pretty good. Um, I think I'd rather save my money for devil deals, though. If I had a bit more, if I had like 45, I think I'd take it. But with our current money, it's not quite worth it, I don't think. I'm going to use a bomb on the boss here because we've got these uh, more of the void bombs. Ooh, that's a nice bit of money there. Get that penny back. Lovely. Good old cube of poop. Right, quickly exit here. Go back in. See if we can get a little bit more money out of these. I think considering we didn't get a devil deal here, I'm willing to go back and buy the toy drum. Uh, especially considering we were up to 41, which is nearly at the threshold that I just stated. So I feel like it's a half decent idea. And toy drum, it's like, it's not crazy good because you only have a small window to get that extra damage. But I think like, it's probably a solid like 25% or maybe maybe 20% DPS upgrade overall. Like you get, I think it's like 0.25 of a second of... um of extra damage every other second. Something like that. I don't know the exact numbers. Anyways, down to the next floor. Remember that we're trying to go beast here, right? I think. Beast, beast, boss rush, or delirium. We've got a few different choices here, but delirium's probably not in the cards for us. That was a great push. Not gonna lie. That was a great push by that dude. Good. Try and get these where I can. Lovely pennies. We want to always be at 30 coins. 30 is enough for a two-heart devil deal if one should show up. And 
obviously with us going actual devil deal, but also going um, item room devil deal, there is a reasonable chance of that happening. Good. Lovely devil. Devil's probably going to be more valuable in the long run here. Let's let's grab the devil. But yeah, up to 39 cent now. That's really good. We've, we've been pretty lucky with money like in secret rooms and on the floor and stuff recently. I could bomb those mushrooms for a chance at magic mush. So I, I guess I should. I've got quite a lot of bombs here. Unfortunately, didn't get the uh, play payoff there. One downside about the toy drum is unfortunately because of our low fire rate, it's slightly difficult for us to time it correctly to take full advantage. Nah, no pills this run. I feel like characters like the Keeper, you don't want to be messing around with pills. Getting a, t a tier rate down would be devastating. I'm just going to kind of let this guy do his thing. Let that fly suck up his poops. Destroy all the ones we can so he's not got more to go for. And then just kill him here. Boom, bow. Easy enough. Oof, this room's rough. Like, it's not that hard. It's just going to be a tedious room. We've got another shop here, of course. We do have two keys, so I'll wander in there and see what's what. Three keys now, even better. Um, do, 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 unfortunately, not anything we're looking for there. Up to 41 cents once again. Nice. I right, use the devil card, obviously, in the boss room, but we want to see my item room first, because it might help us kill the boss a little bit easier. I'm really hoping we get a good devil deal at this point, because, like, our devil deals so far, like, our item room devil deals haven't really been that stellar. One, revive, which is safety. It's nice. But it's not, it's not quite what we're looking for, of course. Ringworm, kind of good. But this trinket is potentially better. Ooh, Cuba meat kind of saved me from a hit there. One bow. Nice. Extra bombs is lovely. Always looking for extra bombs when we've got these more bombs. The, the More of the Void Bombs are just so goddamn useful for um, taking out bosses and stuff. Good. Bunch of extra pennies. Hey, here we are. Okay, unfortunately we've got these guys to deal with, which are always a nuisance. See? Hit him! There you go. Right, what do you hold for me? <sighs> Fucking ghost, baby. Ugh. I was like, yeah, I'm hoping for a good devil deal this time. Fucking ghost, baby. Knew it was the chance of some dog shit, but it didn't have to do me like that. Right, rebuild our money once again, of course. I'm doing all the rooms because we're going beast at the minute. I don't, timer is not a big deal. So I'm trying to min max where I can to get as much money as we can possibly get. Good thing about uh, Keeper, we've got no way of losing our devil deal chance. So in that regard, we have some safety of actually producing more good items. Don't know if that hurts me or not. I'm not going to take the risk. <sighs> Steven Floor. Hmm... With good money, Stephen Floor is not a bad idea. We haven't beat Stephen Floor in a little while, but with good money, Stephen Floor is not a bad idea at all. So we'll see what we get from our Devil Deal here, if we get one. 72% chance, we're pretty likely to. We'll use our Devil card here. Yeah, especially against this boss, fucking hell. Okay, we got a coin at least, that's good. This boss isn't actually that bad, but it has a few attacks that kind of wig me out, and he moves in ways that uh, also wigs me out. That's the attack that wigs me out. <laughs> right. Good stuff. 
that's not great. It does undo our look upgrade. Uh, our look downgrade, should I say, sorry. And we do get a puzzle piece. Oh, this is unfortunate. If we get Lump of Coal, I'll be reasonably happy. But honestly, my look on this guy recently has been really bad. I've been getting um, pretty shafted. Yeah. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Krampus Devil Deal. So at the minute, I'd say we're in a pretty rough spot. Um, we do have to sort of remember that if we go Steven Floor, we don't get a Devil Deal item room. So, is it worth it? I don't think it's worth it, you know. I don't think it's worth it. Like, we lose out on a shop and a Devil Deal item room. I think both of those are pretty valuable to us right now. Ah, <sighs> we're really, really hoping for something good. Because that, yeah, that last Devil Deal and Devil Deal item room were both pretty terrible. Yeah. Kind of a rough room here, I'd say. Luckily, these guys aren't that hard to avoid. But still a bit of a nuisance nonetheless. There you go. Not too bad. Oh, <sighs> yeah. When we're sort of building up a streak again, I know this isn't a crazy streak run at the minute, but when we're starting to build a streak again, certainly it adds some new stress to the runs. Um, and it's, it's, it's more so stressful when it's a run like this, where things just aren't quite going right. The minute they are certainly not going right. I do not like the insanely large amount of tar production going on right now because these guys can hop between the tar locations and it's always a bit spooky. Good. Don't remember what the, the boot guy does. That. Isn't something that happens often. Build our money back up. Didn't mean to automatically pick that up. Dude, he fucking ate the coin as well, you dick. Not only did he steal some money from me, he fucking ate it. Give me it back. There you go. <laughs> it's kind of giving me it back. Not, not quite what I meant, but it works. Be careful when this guy dies. Okay, no coin in this room. What are you doing, big boy? The fear here is quite nice. All of these guys are feared, but don't seem at afraid of me at all. That wasn't an ideal hit for me. What do you do? I, some of these enemies, I completely forget what they do. Use fear to keep these guys away from me. Okay. All y'all dead. Good, good. No coins still, it's annoying. Okay, unfortunately, all the wrong way. Big sad. We're on Dank Depths 1 already. This is not a good run for that late into the game, I've got to say. Not a good run. I have a feeling that this Devil Deal is going to end up being an active item. I just... I don't know. The game seems to like doing that to me recently, and I'm I'm not particularly hopeful. There's a dice room there. I, I guess I'll I guess I'll check the dice room. It could be useful. Ooh, these guys are a little annoying. Oh fucking What the hell? I've never ever seen that enemy have one of their dudes go that far away from like the origin. Jumper cables is pretty good. Yeah, jumper cables is pretty good. I feel like we have to um, we have to check what our devil deal and such is first, though, because they're obviously more important to spend our money on. But jumper cables being able to um, gain more charges of our active with it being a one room charge is pretty good. I would say, I would say it's pretty good. Oh, bugger. If I don't get hit, I'll just want to say, if I don't get hit here, I'll be surprised. If I don't die here, I'll be surprised. Wow, yeah. Unfortunate. Okay. We have died. That's, this has changed things. Dude, this room's fucking horrendous. <laughs> oh, 
Dude, this room is evil. There's so many spiders for a room like this. Right, okay. Quickly, let's take a little look-see at what we've got going on. So we can go to Light Path here as Fiend. This is a little bit of an awkward one because we're quite sort of late into the game. Um, dude, I'm having such a hard time right now. I don't think we're going to be living as Fiend here. Oh my god, what is with these waves? They're evil. They are evil. <laughs> yeah, they are evil through and through. Even this hand is, like, really bad for us. No, okay. Well, that's the streak gone. Um, I don't even know what to say here. Do I do I continue this episode? It feels like I don't... I've done enough. Maybe I'll go do, like, a small challenge or something. Ugh, that was gross. <laughs> That was so gross. Um, fuck it. Let's let's let, let's throw another ultra hard attempt in here. <laughs> Why not? I like the ultra hard attempts. The fun. The unlock for ultra hard isn't even remotely worth it either. That's the funny thing. But I want to give it a go. Kernhead? Nah, Kernhead isn't. Oh wait, yeah, actually, to be fair, let's. I didn't reach the other thing. Okay. Let's try and give this a go. But that that was that was rough. That that room with us, all the spiders was bad. That goddamn thingy room was even worse. No hand. No thank you. That's HP. It's not ideal, but it's HP. If I can get into that library and it's got a good book in it that there's a HP generator, this could be a good run. But let's let's play on that. Shall we? Let's play on that. Let's see how that goes. Cookbook. Kindling book. And poop book. So let's have a look. Cookbook only has a chance to make a food collectible, spawns a heart, spawns a blue fly, or spawns, fl um, or spawns flies. The hearts that can spawn... So unfortunately, this is... Um... There's a fixed 25% chance this book activates a second time. I don't really know, because the chance to spawn a food collectible is good, the chance to spawn a heart is pointless. And the poop book... Um, what charge is this? For one room charge? Burning effect to every in the room. Eventually, it'll burn out and drop the burnt book. What does the burnt book do? I'm gonna try this for now. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? Okay, it can spawn enemy flies too. I didn't expect that. We've got bookworm already, which is nice. That's some amount of additional damage being able to be dealt. But yeah, being able to give us HP up sounds very, very good. Oh, what a bad hit that was. That was just truly awful. What's, what's this guy doing? He's like bumbling about like an absolute moron. I need you to get to a point where I can hit you rather than behind all this stuff. Okay, good. I'll check what's in there. Charged pennies pretty goddamn good. Okay, this is one of those type of rooms where we basically just have to re re uh, hope that everything kills each other. Cool, that, that worked out pretty well for us. Extra bombs is nice. Yeah, this is an interesting start to a run. Like, I don't know what the chances are for this, um, this book to give me HP. And I don't know if it can give me it more than once. But I feel like any amount of chance of it is probably good. We'll see what the bosses give us here to see how this run's going to progress. Ooh, this is a rough, a rough version of Gemini here. Because that poison is uh, going to trap us every now and again. Yeah, I got him. I don't know if you're going to do anything different. Not by the looks of it. 
champion version of uh, the little baby Gemini, whatever he's called. Something beginning with a C. It's never normally that hard. He's just a little baby boy that we can bounce around. And we get a little synth oil. Good, good, good. Okay, I'm guessing that is also a damaging creep. Although, I'll be honest, I cannot tell because it's not its not flashing, so maybe it isn't. But it'd be weird. It'd be weird, wouldn't it? If it wasn't damaging creep. Good. Devil deal we don't want. Toy drum is also reasonably nice here. Okay. We shall carry on. And I'm hoping Charge Penny plus this book pays dividends here. We'll see. We'll see. So we don't have keys at the minute, so don't fret about item rooms yet. This guy's going to split into another two of himself, which is annoying. Getting two damage ups, though, from the bosses is rather nice. Ooh, that's a very good trinket. A very good trinket. This is tricky. Flat file is very helpful on a multitude of rooms and gives us free care room access. I think it's better. I think it's better. Well, that's tricky. That's a tricky one because Charge Penny can be good if the... Um... Oh, dude. Charge Penny can be good if the uh, amount of pennies we get is high, but it's conditional. Whereas this uh, flat file is not conditional. It's always going to be useful. Every floor, there's, well, not every floor, but most rooms is a cursed uh, door, cursed room, and m there's a lot of rooms with spikes. It's more guaranteed value, I feel like. And also as well, like, this, this book has unknown value to us. Like, being able to charge this book more might be amazing. It might be f***ing useless. We don't really know. Getting both item rooms like this is very nice. Do not like the, uh, the big mini monster. Cool, that's helpful. It's one of them. Joyful is, I think, good. Don't you dare steal my charges. I'm one off. Brother Bobby is, of course, useless. Yeah, I think this book's going to be mostly useless for us. Because it's just the, the most thing, most common thing it's going to do is produce HP, which drops on the floor. It doesn't heal us. Activates the joyful effect instantly. Uh, using three joy pills within ten rooms, periodically apply the addicted effect to you. Okay, no thank you. We'll just keep with the on hit effect, thanks. Good. Extra key there, nice. Tinted rock unfortunately isn't super valuable for us, but we gotta try them. The blood on the floor is, however, reasonably valuable. Okay. Cool. Now, where we go? No, thank you. That, I think this is a, ha a half-decent run so far. I think our boss items here need to be really good. Um, otherwise, we're going to have troubles. I don't really know where I'm going right now. <laughs> These enemies are so annoying. At least they're not champions. I think second wave enemies can't be champions. Which is rather nice. Yeah, these are the blue boys that split into shots, I'm pretty sure. This guy's going to cheer. Yeah, he's going to say, News going to chase me down at a bad time. Extra key for our next item rooms is lovely. Should we get there? I'm not exactly sure what to think of you. Pushing you over rocks is actually somewhat beneficial to us right now, so I'm going to keep doing it. Lovely. Extra bomb. Nice. 
Take out the harder enemy first. Don't worry about the dippies. Just some flies. Okay. Not an ideal room for us. Try and take out the... Oh, dude, I've just realised there's an invisible guy chasing me. Yeah, there's pretty much no way I could get out of that without taking damage. I didn't see the invisible guy. I saw him too late. There was too much creep about by that point. Ah, bugger. I don't know where I'm going here. I'm, I'm very confused on where I am and where I'm meant to be going. These XL floors are a bummer. Oh, he actually got me? Heck. Oh, dude, this... This active item has, has been kind of trash. Ooh, that noise he makes there is... Oh, God, the fire. God damn it. Things have not gone well here. Things have not gone well. Not a ridiculously hard boss, though. Not an easy boss, but not a ridiculously hard one, either. The red version of this guy is probably the easiest version, I think. He did summon some stuff. That's one of them dead. Yeah, I don't like you summoning these guys. They have a lot of health because they're meant to be showing up later in the game. Oh, that was very close. And we get ourselves HP. Yes, it's HP. And then what we got going on here? Pin plus Blighted Irvum. Weird combination, but not particularly bad, I don't think. I think Blighted Irvum is the uh, number one cause for concern. Okay, good. We got him. And yeah, you're kind of a pushover at this point. Good, good. We got an angel deal as well. GMO Con could be terrible. That angel deal. That angel deal better still be open. <laughs> oh, we got a lot of HP out of that, but we did get a tears down and among other things. We got a damage up. I mean, GMO Con is genuinely not bad. Oh, really? Taking us into rooms we haven't been into yet. Oh no. These rooms are not even easy either. That that angel deal better still be open. I'm going to be really pissed if it's not. Which I know it's not going to be. I mean, come on now. The game is never, ever that kind. Hello. Death cap. Wowie. Um... Take damage. Yeah, definitely no taking damage from me, thank you. I will be re-rolling that into whatever else we get from here. Orphan Socks. Um, so we no longer... Orphan Socks is like no longer taking damage from spikes, right? Maybe Charge Penny's better? Yeah, I'm probably going to take Charge Penny at this point. Because the cash rooms are just not something I'm going to find easily. I don't know where the flippity feck I'm going anymore. I've completely lost where the, uh, the boss room was. And I keep accidentally entering into rooms I haven't been in before. God damn it. Right. Where's the fucking trinket gone? Oh my god, I'm so lost. Okay, okay. Yeah, I fucking knew it. I mean, at least GMO Corn is good, but there's a bit sad to lose an angel deal there. It could have been something good for us. Hell's Bells. It's always the thing with GMO Corn. I mean, obviously we didn't know we were taking GMO Corn, which is the harder part about that. We had no choice in it. Oh, God. Oh, God. I've just realized how ultimately fucking awful this room is.
My brain does not do these cross hatchy boys. Thank you for not being as big of a pain of an ass as you could have been. Death effect, that's nice. You being a champion is scary as shit. Oh my god, I didn't know you did that. Since when did you do that? Fuck. Oh, there's some enemies in Fiendfolio that I still have very little to no idea how they actually work. Oh, dude, this guy with creep? No, thank you. Oh, my God, that was horrible. Oh, my God, I just don't understand how some of these bosses and stuff work. Yeah, this isn't good. Oh, dude, I can't even fucking find this guy. This is... Dude, this is horrible. <laughs> Oh no, this is the fucking most evil shit I've ever seen. I can't. <laughs> I can't fucking do this room. I lost so much HP there. That was evil. Evil room design right there. Okay, so we've taken a bit of a tumble. These headless freaks, please stop. We've taken a bit of a tumble, a bit of a fall from grace. This book is thoroughly fucking useless at the moment. What's going on here exactly? Very, very confused by this amalgamation of... Why isn't this guy popping his head up, like, even once? I'm gonna bomb you guys. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the way that you were formed confuses me. I don't. I don't want to deal with that. We found our boss, but that doesn't really. I got hit. Okay. 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 I guess I'll hold a joyful pill. Right. I do not like it when Curse of the Maze activates without my permission. I can't believe you cursed the mazed when I specifically asked you not to. Good. Definitely not giving you HP, I'm sorry, but a recipe for disaster right there. No way. Why? Why did you Pac-Man me? Fuck. Sick. Right, quickly. Okay, okay, okay. This way, this way. Okay, I got pac man It was a little scary. It was a little scary. Actually, quite a lot of free stuff in the Pac-Man room, to be honest. Lots of free pennies. Okay, there's a there's a jumpy dude about. How did I not get hit there? Okay, I did get hit there though. Who, oh, baby? Like cast the maze again. What's going on with this game right now? I'm so confused. <laughs> What's with all of these guys? Can I can these guys fuck off? I'm just gonna bomb them because they're really annoying to deal with. That unfortunately didn't work into my favour, really. Where's our item rooms at? Where are they at? Oh, this book! Man, give me a, a HP up one time, please. Pawn mines, no thank you. There's just so many ways to go, and I don't know where I've been and where I haven't. 
I've been this way apparently. Who'd have known? I've been this way apparently too. How? <laughs> How have I been all these ways but not into this middle room? <gasps> this is so confusing. Oh my god, it's Pac-Man room again. Where haven't I been? I'm so confused. Have I been here? I've been here. Have I been here? I've been here. I've been here. Oh my god, I'm so confused. This is melting my small, small, pea-sized brain. I can't figure out where to go. <laughs> so we've been here. We've been here. We've been here. Have we been here? We've, we haven't been here. Okay. Okay, this guy having the, the magnetic force pull thing does not bird well. Although he did die pretty quick. How have I not seen an item room yet? I'm so confused. I feel like I've been wandering around Vega for so long. What am I hoping this will be? I don't even know. I don't even know, man. Magic mush, because it fully heals us. Not fucking kamikaze. That's something I was hoping it wasn't. Kamikaze was definitely not on my list. Also, telefragging boys, be very careful. Nope. I have often socks. What am I doing? Oh, stupid. Oh, the spike. The spike. Sad bombs? We've got some interesting bombs going on. I can see forever. Don't know where I'm going now. I've been this way before. Boss was up this way, I think, somewhere. Up and to the right, maybe. There it is. The rag boys. Oh, what the fuck? That's a thing you do? Okay. Bandage binder. I don't remember what bandage binder does. We got fiend mum, which isn't great. Don't really remember what fiend mum does. Dude, this little enemy's a bitch. Stop moving! Get stepped on. God, Fiend Mum's enemy spawns are pretty horrific. Oh my god, this is so stressful. That was stressful indeed, although we're going down to the womb with basically no hope right now. <laughs> I I am looking for a rainbow poop and that is pretty much it. We got the fucking boss instantly, but we still need to survive this room, which I honestly think isn't super likely. This book. This book, man. 
This is literally disgusting. Why is there so many spikes? Why is there two, two of the guys with Herming? This is horrible. This is evil. Oh, dude, you can't just keep spawning these flies. I like the way that the, the blocks just push him towards me. I'm going to have another go at this. This has been a crazy weird episode, but I'm... Do you know, I really enjoy doing this, so you guys are getting an extra length episode. Fuck it. Like, a, a, and I mean a really hella extra length episode. Um... Technically, Nord Leaf is kind of insane. So, I'm going to see what my other item room is. I would say, provided it's close, and luckily it is. Oh, God, what's with the spike block rooms? Please. Fuck these rooms, man. Not actually that hard, looking at it now. Nah. It needs to be something that works with Nord Leaf for that to be a run I want it to stick with. Okay, Proptos is a pretty goddamn good start. As if I got hit there, goddamn, that was so stupid of me. Oh! Wait! Wait a minute. Wait a minute, I've never considered Leech. Does Leech work? Leech works, okay. This is incredible. I never considered how good Leech is on this goddamn challenge before. I've never even thought about Leech as a contender, but goddamn, is he the best lad you've ever seen. We still need some good boss items and stuff to make this work. That's a soul heart, that's something at least. We've got tech pin here as well. Oh god, that was so stupid of me. Soapbox, isn't soapbox plus two healing at the end of... Yeah, heal two, okay. This is... This is... This is it. <laughs> this might be the one, people. Like, I'm not saying that, that, like, this is a guaranteed win by any means. There's still a lot, a lot, and a lot that could go wrong here. This room's horrible for Proptosis also. But... Leech plus Surf Box here is a very, very good combo. We've just got to get more actual Red Heart containers. Then we're in a really good spot. God damn, my commentary is definitely going to go downhill from here, though, because my focus is going to be very high. Get out of here, you. This room's horrible. <laughs> what is it with this game and, like, playing this challenge? It's like, here, here's the worst rooms imaginable. Like, all these goddamn bubbles plus the frog, Why? Why do you do me dirty like that? I can't even get to the goddamn frog. Barely hit him. He's just nestled in all, all this crap. I can't <laughs> do anything here. Finally. Oh my god, that room was... Ugh. Imagine if you could overheal you. Strength, tower. I guess tower we just pop. 
didn't do much for us, unfortunately. And then strength. What strength do? It weakens an enemy. I guess we can keep that for a hard boss. It only works for a minute, though, so it's not foolproof. This is also another really gross room. <laughs> at least we found our boss, the, our boss, our item room there. Only thing with prop toast is obviously we're having to get really close in order to make, like, take advantage. Right, and we could also get an item that just ruins everything. Pause is, pause is maybe good. I don't know, I'm undecided. Basically, I have to try something out here. I have to see how much... How, if Leech can damage while Pause is active. Because if he can, it's pretty good. That was nice. Thank you. It's only three pennies, but... Oh, it was a look up. Okay, not bad. Right, so wait until Leech is on top of one of these guys, and then pause. Okay, Leech can do damage while we're paused. This is good to know. Now, Leech's damage, of course, isn't amazing, but it's still damage nonetheless. So basically, with this combo, if we desperately need healing and the rooms are just not very kind to us, we have a way of getting it. Now, currently, because of that Curse of the Maze pull, I have absolutely no idea where I am or where I'm going. This guy's a real piece of shit. Or if I'm in a room that's just really tricky, I could just let this dude take care of everything for me. I can't remember how long pause pause is for. King Worm, unfortunately, is pretty bad. Techno pin again. Oh, so stupid of me. Oh, that was even more stupid. Right, Leechy boy, where, where you at? Where you at? Okay, Leech has unfortunately latched onto a boss, which is not what I was expecting. Okay, good. Right, now let's try and take you out first and leave the minions you've summoned. Some of them, at least. Doesn't need to be all of them, at least two. Right. Now, Leechy boy, you start doing some business. I'm really hoping for a HP up here, because the more heart containers we have, the more useful Leech actually is. That's not... Well, that is damage, though. Damage is useful for us. Unfortunately, these bosses are pretty rough for us because we have to stand so close to them to do good damage. Good thing is he's leave, leaving behind some uh, spiders for us. Which would be good if I didn't keep getting hit. God damn it. Come on, give us a HP up, please. GMO corn, a damage up. Okay. Not ideal, because now I don't know where the fuck I am. I'm probably going to end up going through some rooms I don't want to go through. Like this one. GMO corn is good, because it was a big damage up. Big damage ups cannot be understated how useful they are. And it's also HP up as well, GMO corn. So, GMO corn, pretty, pretty goddamn good for us here. Yeah, now we're, we've got this problem of we have no idea where we are and where we're going, but we've seen both item rooms, so we have absolutely zero reason to stay on this floor. This isn't ideal. And apparently there's a fucking load of rooms I haven't done yet as well, which I wouldn't be expecting. Right, uh... Leech, can you, like, do your business, please, and actually get on this guy rather than chilling next to me? Leech! Come on, Leech. Fuck's sake. Get on him. There you go. <sighs> slowly, slowly, catchy monkey. 
What the hell's this? This is horrible. Another heal there for us there. Right. Leech, latch onto that guy. He's in a position where I can't really shoot him. We do have a library here, which could be good. Friend Folio's good. Book of Secrets doesn't do anything for us. Literally doesn't do anything, because, uh... Wait. This guy could give us a HP up. Rare for 10 cent, or 11 cent, should I say, but could happen. Justice is also kind of nice. Darn you. Darn you, boy. Yeah, I have no idea where I am at this point in time. I don't remember how I got to the boss. I don't think it was up. Up doesn't seem right. Stop peering next to the wall, goddammit. Oh, how is there this many rooms I haven't done yet? God damn. Ugh. Ooh, hoo, hoo. annoyed I did that in this room because it's going to be annoying, but now I can go back to that beggar after I've done this shenanigan. This is going to be a fucking long, long, long episode. My goodness, boys. We're in for a treat today. We're in for a treat today. Okay, good, good, good. We've got 10 more cent. Let's quickly go back and try and play that beggar a little more. Oh, we've got another room we haven't been to before. I, I I swear, I don't even know how this room's left. I feel like I've done, like, a thousand rooms this floor. Where was that beggar? I don't even really know. This way? This way? Yes, okay, okay, okay. That is, unfortunately, not what we wanted in terms of HP ups, but we can heal that damage up easily, so not terrible. Right, now we just got to find our way back to wherever the hell the boss room was. Good bit of healing there. Oh, wait, we can move while we're paused. I didn't know that. So Leech can just... Do his thing. I thought it was when we moved, it stopped. Okay, this is a lot more useful than I thought, then. Also, it seems to last a lot longer than I remember. Beautiful stuff. Here's the boss rooms. Good, good, good. God damn it, GMO Corn, you are useful, but also just confusing as shit. Down we go. Ugh, this is crazy, this one. We heal two at the start of every floor as well, hell yes. I'm going to take a risk and go in here. Haunted Rose, what does Haunted Rose do again? Taking damage may spawn souls, bombs may be ghost bombs, um, eternal hearts spawn in pairs. Not bad, not bad. Leech. Leech, please. It's very annoying when the leech just doesn't latch. It's a very annoying grouping of enemies here. Okay, there's our heal. Nice. I just. I never thought about how goddamn good leech would be on this challenge. I don't know how. It's so obvious when I think about it. I just need a bit more damage now. I mean, damage is good, but it could be a lot better. You've got to remember, we got to do Mega Satan. And Mega Satan with 
low damage prop to us is going to be rough. Oh god. Oh, what am I, what am I meant to do to get out of the way of that? Ghosties, take care of him. Secret room items coming our way. Ooh, 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 ooh. What's, what's this do? Picking up a soul heart with empty red hearts will convert it to red hearts at two times rate, plus two HP up, heal three hearts on pickup. Okay, that's amazing for us right now. Okay, I'm in a, I'm in a happy place right now. This isn't an end-all be-all, because the thing is, we still need enough, like, damage and stuff to be able to actually goddamn do the, um... Be able to goddamn do the Mega Satan fight, but... That's why I'm keeping the Strength card on tap right now. That's pretty good. We lost our Angel deal chance, but... Let's be real, that was never gonna happen anyways. Rainbow, Rainbow Poop, knowing that's there is good. You know what? Let you spawn your shit. Let, uh, let my leech take care of him. Okay, just, uh, I don't even know what hit me there. Very confused. These ones aren't paused. Okay, we're back up to full health anyways now. Ah, bugger you guys. Honestly, I can, I can play very risky now. The setup I've got going on. Extra bomb. Thank you. Oh, what the fuck? I was very confused then. Thank god it didn't teleport me into the mum boss. Unfortunately, we are going to be getting the terrible item here from this guy. It does block shots, I guess, but it's overall not great for us. Right, we still need to find our item rooms here, so don't bother with that yet. Yeah, not much I can do to get away from that. Ghosts, can you chill out? Okay. What's that doing with his bones? Can you can you eat these? No, you can't. Wait, you can eat the fly though. Do you want to just eat that fly for me? Thank you. No, oh, that was a really bad hit. Right, let's let this guy do his thing for a little bit here. Okay, my ghosts don't move when I pause. My leech does, but my, my ghosts don't. I also have pause plus um, an, an orbital now, which is good damage. This guy's taking a while to kill. One pause might not even do this. Let me stand back a little bit. Oh, no, it's good. We're good. The pause functionality with healing has, uh, has really elevated this run. Something fierce. Fortunately, we got one of these bad boys. Luckily, escaped narrowly. Okay, you always hit me. Let's stay back. Chariot is good, but our card is better. Right, at the minute, not exactly sure where we're going. We're looking for our item room, but we don't know where that would be. Yeah, I knew I was getting hit there. There you go, up to full. Paul's only be a two-room charge as well is another thing that's kind of amazing. It's because most of the time it's pretty useless. Cootie, doing some good stuff there. The Fiend Folio, Friend Folio book, whatever it's called, was pretty good too. Pretty good pickup for us. Decent enough. 
Mm. Don't know where we are now. In terms of where we've been and where we haven't. This is gross. Yeah, let's just uh, let our ghosties do all the work here. Thank you. Right, let's let you get one of these flies. Lovely. And then these guys are going to be annoying for a small room like this. Don't think I'll need golden keys really, but there was a tinted rock in there as well, so we've got an extra key. Okay, these, these guys are the ones that don't die until everything dies. Good. Okay. Narrowly avoided anything happening there. Binky, hell yes. Fire rate up has finally bought our DPS a little bit higher, that's nice. Okay, still really confused when we haven't, haven't been. We're getting there though, I think. I'm guessing both the item rooms are going to be in a very similar location. Good. Good. Okay. Annoying room. It's okay though. Loss of a soul heart is what it is. Thank you for the penny. There's one item room at least. We got one. No idea what the second could be. <sighs> All that work and you get the fucking bean. I mean, I'm not that bothered because it's like we have a good run now. Like... It's just, come on. It could have been something a little better. Okay, here's our second. Oh, that is gross. That's some sadistic shit right there, game. Right, leechy boy. Do your work for me. Heal me up some. Oh, the bloody fly boy killed him. God damn it. Reheated pizza. Another HP up. Good, good, good. Right. Now we've got to find where the boss room was again, which I'm particularly unsure of. I think it's over to the right here, but no, it's not. Okay. Shop should be, like, up here somewhere as well, I think. No. Nah. Very, very confused. But yeah, yeah, okay. We know where we are now. The shop is here. Quickly check out the shop. Buy whatever this is. Toy drum. Nice bit of DPS increase. Lovely. Lovely. Right, on to mum. Here we are. It's Fiendish Mum again, though. Fiendish Mum's... I don't know if Fiendish Mum is the hardest one. It's the one I'm most likely to be hit against. Not worried about HP because I get two heals at the end of the floor, remember? We grab that. That's more damage. Good stuff. And down we go. Okay. Things are looking good. Things are looking good. <laughs> That's so funny. Normally it's meant to have a different, like, random heart in it, that pizza box. Now it's just like, no, no heart. Okay. Let's hope we can have a pretty quick turnaround with uh, getting through this floor. Unlikely, I know, but a man can hope. Don't walk into those poops, that would be idiotic. 
What do these guys do again? Is it just... Okay, they just jump around and then shoot periodically. That's fine. I can deal with that. Check this out. Three room. Rerolls all pickups. Um, trinkets on the entire floor. Golden bombs will take. In fact, we'll take all these bombs. Money is useless to us. So let's just reroll it. Nothing good. Okay. This isn't too bad. Grey champions are the best. Grey champions have half HP, so they die very, very quickly. At the minute, I'm also trying to keep my angel deal alive than anything. How have I ended up back here? <laughs> What happened there? <laughs> that was confusing. I'd like to keep my angel deal alive, but it's not obviously very likely. Take care of that. Oh my god, the fucking burns on those things get flung so goddamn far. This dude's just, ugh. Pills and a thank you. Yeah, had a feeling that was coming. Right. Let my leech do some work here. Okay, my ghosts are actually just going to kill everything here, so my leech got no chance. Okay, this is another room that I can't, unfortunately, leave my leech to do everything yet. But now I can. Damn it, leech. Range is nice. Actually, it's too range now. They fixed it finally. Okay, we got the heal, and there's the boss room. Nice. Two left. Good, good, good. Little demon chest. Um, black rune. Black Rune's probably not that useful, really, is it? Remember, we've got um, thingy bombs here, golden bombs. Plop them down for the ghosts, at least. Ah, oh, really, he jumped at that perfect time. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Okay, we got that, and from here we get... Oh, yes, damage multiplier. That's lovely. Oh, dude, that cactus is in a terrible position there. This is pretty much going to be a bomb-only kill, I think. Okay. Annoying bit of the fight here, but not all-round terrible. Go. We go down. Oh, we're getting to the final bits of this run that's scaring the hell out of me. We heal up two at the start of the floor. Lovely. Oh, really? Now, to be fair, this guy could give me some good stuff. I don't really care about getting, getting hit by you, to be honest. Oh, no. Not if I get hit three times by you, though. Come on now. Don't be a dick. Yeah, you could be an item at least. Cambion Conception, god damn it. It's kind of terrible for us. Right. I'm gonna need to play my heals where I can here. Probably won't do enough damage to kill this guy, I wouldn't think. He's got the thingy champion thing on his head. Had a feeling. Should oh, should have thought about the ghost. So the ghost could steal the kill now, isn't it? Are these things teleport? So I don't even know if it's worth leech latching onto this guy. Yeah, 
Probably not. Oh no, we got it. We got the heal. Nice. Hello, good sir. Fortunately, this guy can hit me pretty goddamn easily, so... Nice. Again, I don't really need these coins for anything, really. I guess I could find a beggar, so I might as well pick him up. Might as well. So, I'll go up to 30. Leechy boy, do your thing. It's a very slow strategy, this, but it works. Works mighty well. Try to be ready for when it unpauses. Okay, we're back up to full HP now. Baby Bender doesn't do anything for us, I don't think. Well, I like the way those guys join up there. That's cool. Right, he is just... Luckily, it's only one floor, so we don't have to worry too much about the whole idea of... Um, God. The whole idea of... Uh, having to randomly walk through a floor until we find what we need. But still, it's not going to be easy. Ank is an extra life, which is pretty incredible for us, to be honest. Unfortunately, this boss, not good for being close to, due to obvious reasoning. Basically, my biggest worry at the moment is once we actually get to... Um, yeah, we can't really do anything this floor. Once we actually get to fight Mega Satan, we're not going to be able to heal enough to get through the fight, is my major worry right now. Right, get him low. Oh, I was going to try and get him low, then let Leech kill him, but... Buggered it up. Yeah, I don't like you guys. I don't know how much health you have, but I'm going to try and let Leech kill you. Oh, for God's sake, I keep forgetting about the goddamn ghosts. I don't want the ghosts. The ghosts are going to steal my Leech's kill. Yeah, fuck's sake. Right, Leech, do your thing on this guy. Good, good. Please get one hit and then let Leech do the rest. Oh, I got hit anyways. It was fucking worthless. This seems like a good room to get some heals on. Don't use a bomb. I was going to use a bomb on her, but... I don't know how much health the mammy has, so... Uh, might take longer. Okay, nice. And last heal here. Back up to full again. Lovely. Back up to full. Now, unfortunately, we don't know where we're going at the minute, so that's a bit rough. Yeah, very much do not want to know where I'm going here. This is a bugger, this is. I think we went the wrong way. I don't really know what this guy does. Sure, it's not good, though. Really? You're gonna fear me straight away? As soon as I walk in the room. I guess it's technically worth checking what's in these. Ah, there's an item in that one.
Why can't I hurt you? Okay, there we go. Right. And here we go. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, I fucking mistimed that terribly. At least I got some ghosts out of it. Ghosts are pretty strong. Like I said, problem is, I have to get very close to deal good damage. Did that not deal any damage? I don't think it did. Ah, bugger. Yeah, I knew I was taking damage there, God damn it. Right, through here we go. Now the question is, do I try and heal up these two hearts before I go in here or not? Oh no, I don't need to. Oh, great. I don't think I take any of these, right? I don't think I take any of these. I think we just go for this and hope for the best. Um, question is, where do I pop my strength card? Because it gives me... Let, let me just check. It gives me... Enemies are weakened, um, slowed and take double damage. Effect lasts one minute. Hmm. I think I probably do use it first phase, to be honest. So it affects every enemy in the room, right? I don't know why that hand died so fast. I think it was because of the cactus, maybe? Okay, it does affect every enemy in the room as well, so this is good. If we can get through all the phases of this... Okay, can you stop with the sides, please? Way too alarming amount of sides. <sighs> Bugger you. At least the ghosts do a ton of damage. Oh, unfortunately, we're already up. The time is already up. I, that minute went by fast. Good thing is here we can heal up. Oh, as long as we're fucking careful, that is. Yeah, unfortunately, now we can't heal up because my ghosts are about doing their thing. I'm going to kill everything instead of my le leech being able to do it. I'll still leave it just in case my leech can get a few kills. The ghosts are both good for damage, but also not good for us overall. Get away with your bombs, sir. I never remember which one of these guys is the most deadly, so I never know which one to prioritize. That was bad. Oh, what the fuck? No, 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 no. Oh, my God. That was horrible. I got penned in there. My cactus has luckily spawned in a location that's pretty goddamn useful to me. Don't remember what this does. Yep. Knew I was going to take damage there. Okay, good. I think my ghosts have got this. Ah, <sighs> god damn. Okay. Not got much health left to do this with, so we got to be careful here. We're doing very, very good damage to him. These fires are awful.
I think I'm stuck here, aren't I? I think I'm taking damage. Oh, wait, no, I'm good, I'm good. That bomb did not go where I wanted it to. Oh, baby. Oh, my God, it's done. It's fucking done. Oh, my God. I feel so good about that. Holy shit, that was such a good run. Oh my god, did not expect this episode to end this way, but either way, I hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.